Yes. Mm. Okay. And we're good to go. Okay. I clap yet? Yes. Now? Mm -hmm. Ooh. I was a good student. Everybody liked me because I was always happy and I always made everybody laugh. I left Gage Park my sophomore year. I moved to Louisiana because my granddaddy was sick and me and my mom wanted to be down there so she could be close to him. And I stayed down there for seven months. And when I was living down there, I didn't, I didn't have nobody and I didn't really go out with my cousin. So I got depressed. And then my mom left me for three months by myself. I was with my uncle who I didn't know that well. And she missed my birthday. She barely called. And I was just, I was alone. And I was really sad. And then she came back, but it was, it was just like a, you here now, but you wasn't here the whole time when I was sad and I didn't have nobody. Zari says that they went to Louisiana like on a vacation to visit family. And these were people that she didn't know. She like maybe met them once or twice, but she had no relationship with the, these particular family members. So when they got there, her mom was with her and then suddenly she wasn't. And they were really close before. So to go and be left there, that really did like rocked her very significantly, which is why she ended up being so anxious and so fearful because she really did suffer from some of that separation anxiety. It was sophomore year when I came back. Even though I came back to Gage and like I had all my friends that I had before, I still just wasn't happy. And then my cousin passed away and it was really, really hard. Zari was one of 38 students on my caseload. Zari is probably the student I saw the most during the course of the school year. She really began to take ownership of herself as a student and saw, saw the fact that she could really excel. So we spent a lot of time like going through grades and figuring it out. So that, that was one of our greatest areas of growth. At the core of what we do, we want to make sure that our students don't drop out. So um, that's the starting place, but that can be very different from student to student. Zari needed accountability, but she also needed a listening ear. Zari also needed to understand how her thoughts were affecting the way that she behaved. Zari needed to understand that she can be resourced by having this program in her classroom. I grew up so much and I learned so much and I overcame so many things. I know that communities and schools of Chicago helps people in need, like me.